In the landscape of IOL dislocations, few events are as rare as to see the dislocation of angle-supported ACIOL. 31-year-old male presented with sudden diminution of vision in the right eye following a street altercation. He reported a history of cataract surgery with intraocular lens implantation performed one year prior. On slit lamp examination, an inferior iris coloboma was noted. Fundus examination revealed an inferiorly dislocated intraocular lens. To our surprise, the dislocated implant was an angle-supported anterior chamber IOL, an unexpected finding given its intended anatomical placement. A lens designed to anchor securely within the anterior chamber, now lying over the retinal surface, presented a striking deviation from conventional expectations. This video showcases a rare complication and surgical repositioning of the IOL. Following completion of vitrectomy, the IOL was separated from its vitreous adhesions and allowed to fall gently on retinal surface. The IOL was gently flipped using active suction from the back flush needle, allowing it to reorient into the correct anatomical position with minimal manipulation. The haptic of the intraocular lens was grasped using an engripping forceps and carefully elevated toward the pupillary plane. It is crucial to catch hold the trailing haptic, as it allows controlled guidance of the leading haptic into its intended position. Once the leading haptic was securely positioned, the trailing haptic was guided into the anterior chamber. A Sinsky hook proved instrumental in fine-tuning the lens retrieval and orientation. The IOL was then dialed in horizontal meridian away from the inferior coloboma. Pillow carpine was then injected to constrict the pupil.